What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, I know I'm late on this stunner situation, better late than never. The reason why I am late, though, is because I didn't want to get yellowed, and it was just all over the place. If I don't know the right information, for the most part, I'm not putting it out. I'm not putting out a video, so let's get into uh, Be With The Tea. You guys, so get into this craziness. So, stunner girl was the other night and she posted on her IG stories showing off her injury. Now it looked like the bullet went through her upper breast area and baby girl should be happy to be alive. Now she did post her injury on her IG stories but I don't have time to be risking going back and forth with YouTube so you can either see it on the stories you can that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. See it on the blogs on IG or if you have a Twitter account just type in stunner girl and you'll be able to see the injury and she also showed proof that it was in fact a wound because the picture she put up is basically the wound being stitched up and she did elaborate and say it hit above my breast and went out my under pit but she's not giving any detail as to what happened she hasn't told the story as to why she got but people are not feeling sorry for this girl. They feel like she's such an evil spirited person. She deserved to get what she got. Dang. Now let's not act like Stunner Girl is not living that life, baby, because she does. But she listen does. to what Anna Mac had to say about her. Oh, I really told y'all God don't play about me. Wait, wait, wait. Cause what did I tell this bitch? It may not be today. It may not be tomorrow. But you are going to get yours. Every bitch that do some real evil, nasty shit. Why would you say that? Like, what if they didn't know who the pew pew was? And you just putting yourself out there being the pew pew. Stupid. To me, I tell them, even if I don't fight them, you're going to get it. Now this bitch got sh <laughs> Yo, ain't sh funny about that? But I told them. Karma is real. Now this bitch. Like, no shade, bitch. You be wishing death on people. I really hope you don't make it through, bitch. <laughs> ah, got that boom. Nigga. I ain't gonna lie. Everybody kept sending me this. I did not watch it. But now that I'm watching it. This is really spinning. This bitch, now you got shot because you're such an ugly, evil hearted bitch. You do evil shit to bitch. You set bitch up. You try to kill bitch. Now look at you. Lifeline. I don't give a fuck. You bitch. Reap what y'all So, what you put out in this world is what you gonna get back. You try to kill a bitch. True. You try to hurt a bitch. You try to set somebody up. You try to get them killed. That's only coming back 10 times forward, baby. You see how much I got to edit out. That's why I, ah, oh, I hate it. Especially when people don't bother you and they innocent. And you just choose to be a bully bitch. And I fight for your life. And then she doubled down and said, I don't care what you're talking about. You know how many times she harassed hurt people, try to kill people, bro, chase Biggie down with a gun, and you want me to feel mm -hmm. bad for somebody who harassed me for months? And then when I responded, try to harass me again. I hope and pray this makes her sit down and she knows it's not funny. She got sh It's just funny everything that she talk about and do to people she got going on now. And other people added on by saying, Karma is a bitch now. And she play a lot of street games. This is what comes with it, boo. This is what happens when you set people up to get unalive. How y'all mad at her, OMG? Like, huh? Stunner diss the dead all the time. This her sign to change the life she's been living. But what do you guys think? Do you guys think that people I are- I will say that mouth is reckless and she just, you know, she act like she's so gangster. Just not having sympathy for the wrong reasons or the right reasons. Do you think this is Stunner Girl's karma because of the way she lives her life and the things that she has done to people? Y'all let me know what you think in the comments, but that's all I have for you and I'll talk to you later. Yeah, 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 yeah. I could talk about what I wanna talk about. That's y'all problem. Y'all keep trying to come up on somebody else's page and tell them what to talk about. Tell them how to be, bitch. Go fix your life. Don't worry about what I'm talking about. If you don't want to hear me talk, get the fuck off my life. Literally. Whole journey. Like, y'all been here. Since the fact that people really getting unalive down here, like, you a different type of bold. What did she say? To I said I was going to how to be, bitch. Y'all do you think this is stunner girl's karma because of the way she lives her life and the things that she has done to people y'all let me know what you think in the comments but that's all i have for you and i'll talk to you later okay so this is probably some random old live um we're gonna go ahead and 86 not 86 but we're gonna get to the next 
portion of videos because all she I know she just be word be word be word all the way through. Um, all right, so the next thing we're gonna get into is Offset. So Offset apparently was caught up again with the old girl he cheated on Cardi B with before. Um, and he had to come out and say a couple of things, but he got caught lacking out in the same spot. Shorty? Hey, about Shorty? Was definitely sitting at the same table. <clears throat> what? So, okay, in his comments, he said people really need to do the research. I'm at a public place gambling at a casino with a married eight month, with a married eight month year old, uh, pre uh, eight month pregnant woman. What the f I look like being outside publicly cheating? SMD. Am I tripping or was she right beside him? Y'all, let me know. Um, this was his way of clearing things up. <laughs> uh, just to understand. All right. Um, so a girl commented and she said, shake my head. That man wasn't with me. I was already there with my husband, sister and brother. And I'm seven months pregnant. Y'all really have to stop with this type of behavior. The thing is, y'all got to stop cheating and stuff. Um, okay. So she cleared her name on that. And then this offset. Um, okay, this is what he already commented. So let me see what they said on hers. First, she said she was at the casino with her husband. Then in the story, she said her late husband. So was this video old or um, she was staring at that camera like she knew they were caught. So that was her. <laughs> uh, he said, I cheat in private, actually. <laughs> it's completely crazy that I even have to do this. Please, if not for me, please respect my late husband. So he's not alive anymore. I'm just beginning to grieve. Uh, having a night out with my family is definitely not an opportunity for clickbait. I'm carrying the last gift my husband will give this earth. All I want is peace. All I wanted peace. If you're looking for a story, there is nothing to see here. Please respect all families involved. Y'all make up things not caring about the impact. Please stop. I'm pregnant as well. You people are sick as F out here. Uh, Y'all, why must they go into public places and do public things together? Like, shorty, stay in the room. So then when people catch you up and see you, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> in the same spot with the nigga you cheated on, cheated with, and he got a wife, you don't, and it's Cardi B. I mean, come on. What are we talking about? Um, he said, I cheat in private, actually. I feel like that's Offset's baby. How did he even know she was eight months pregnant, though? Girl, I think they're talking about Cardi B. Cardi must have called and raised hell because the way they both tackling this left and right to clear it up when Offset never clears up anything is crazy. He clears it up when he get caught up cheating. Y'all reading is fundamental. She clearly not using pronunciation right. Her correct usage should be out with my late husband, sister, and brother, or out with my sister I love and brother-in-law. I don't know. Chilling with an ex, though. She's pregnant. She's grieving. Nah, that means y'all care about each other. Where Cardi at? Hell, I, clearly uh, they needed somebody to talk to. They needed somebody to talk to. Now, it was also revealed that Cardi B is, in fact, pregnant. And it's actually an article on this whole situation. But honestly, it's just so much to dive into with them. But basically, Cardi B want a divorce. Let me see. Cardi B wants a divorce. Oh, yeah, Cardi B has filed a divorce. That would have been better for me to say. Uh, page six, Reddit. Mm, let me try people. All right, Cardi B files for a divorce from Offset again after six years of marriage. 
On Wednesday, July 31st, Cardi B filed for a divorce from Offset 32 after six years of marriage. Representative from Bodak Yellow Rapper confirmed to People is not based on cheat rumors, but rather has been a long time coming, um, the rep said. So, yeah, of course they're going to go down the line of a bunch of BS, but basically it's also in an article um, that they are no longer and also... <laughs> Cause y'all know I gotta show y'all the proof or whatever. They posted that on the neighborhood talk, and Offset liked the post. Oop! Offset slapped with divorce papers amid being accused of cheating. This is what she wants to do, and he liked that post. So I don't know if he's trolling or what. Um, but at this point, bro, I would I would go ahead and call it a quits. I would call it a quit because he he can't be faithful. It's just not, you know, some people just don't have it in them. And he's one of them. You know what I'm saying? Um, so I would let Cardi B, you know, go on by her business. Um, this is Cardi B's stomach. Y'all know I can't put them titties up there, girl, but that's her stomach. She said, with every ending comes a new beginning. I'm so grateful to have shared the season with you. And you have brought me more love, more life, and most of all, renewed my power. Reminded me that I can have it all. You reminded me that I never have to choose between life, love, and my passion. I love you so much and cannot wait for you to witness what you helped me accomplish, what you pushed me to do. It's so much easier taking life's twists, turns, and tests laying down. But, your, but you, your brother, and your sister have shown me why it's worth the push through. Period. Oh, I'm going to have to just edit this girl sick of it, but that dress is amazing. And shout out to Cardi B. Um, hopefully, you know, she going ahead and call it a quiz. She got three babies out of the deal. Beautiful babies as well. So, baby, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.